the 2017 Paint the Town descended upon the Highland Lakes this week. Artists set up their easels around the area for this annual Pline Air competition. The event, sponsored by the Highland Lakes Creative Arts, drew artists from across Texas and as far as Maryland and California. Bob O'Brien, who participated in the first Paint the Town, explains why it's even better now. Original uh, Paint the Town, we were set up in a tent outside on Main Street. I think uh, our displays were wire meshed and uh, wind blowing through. I think we were allowed to show two paintings. Now we can show up to six, seven, however many. But we were limited just to painting on Main Street. and. There's just so much an artist can glean out of that <laughs> for subject matter. Every year in spring, I take a week off to paint in the hill country. So this is, I'd be out here painting anyway, but a friend of mine did the competition last year. He says, come on, let's go back and do it again. And I said, all right, let's do it. So. Um, here I am. The event wraps up April 1st, but you can still head to the Lakeside Pavilion in Marble Falls to see the art and the artist. Mm -hmm.